So the other day we were out on Africa with a 45 caliber air rifle and I had a lot of fun and we actually took down some Jackal and this thing did amazing. Now this 45 caliber air rifle reminds me of my 17 HMR in real life, uh, maybe even a little bit better because my 17 doesn't exactly drop the animals like this thing does. But that gave me an idea. I want to go out and try and find some varmints with this thing. I want to go out and try and find, let's start out with the fox, move on to jackal, coyote, and maybe even finish off with the wolf. All right, so we got a red fox out here at about 60 yards out. It's a five medium female. And the shot looked pretty good. Might have hit a little bit too low, but she's definitely going down. Now, I don't even know if you can use this on Fox or not, but uh, we're going to anyways. Another Fox! If I could spot it. <laughs> we hit it! Well, hopefully that brings it down. So let's actually give it a little bit of time to go down. Uh, that's pretty cool. We got a bonus. Not just one Fox. We ended up getting two Fox with the 45 caliber air rifle and the hunt just started. So yeah, I was actually only planning on getting one because like I said, I'm pretty sure you cannot use this on the fox. Well, here's one fox and yeah, you cannot use this. And take a look at this score. We ended up getting a 0% quick kill, a 0% integrity and a 0% honor consecutive harvest. We we're actually a little bit too low because that was 70 yards out. We reserved in for 50. So had we aimed a little bit higher, we would have made a nice shot and uh, yeah. And here's our other fox. This is the male that we hit on the run. Hit low again. So 64. Yeah, it starts dropping. It definitely starts dropping at 50. All right, so I know we already have two fox down, but they were both taken with flesh hits. I want to see what happens when we take one down with a vital hit. All right, guys, we got the fox right on top of us. There we go. Okay, so now we made a nice perfect shot. Uh, the other two were flesh hits, but this time I wanted to get a nice vital hit and see what the difference was. And double lung shot at 15 yards out. That's more like it. And now we're back up to 100% consecutive harvest as well. So now we could potentially get either a nice jackal or a big coyote. <gasps> really? I don't know if you know, but this hunt isn't about you this time. Oh yeah? Where is our jackal? Keep running into me once, see what happens. All right, there's our jackal, 111 yards out. We keep getting attacked by a Cape Buffalo, so we better make this quick. Very nice shot. She's going down. All right, well, took care of that problem, I guess. Skull and brain shot, and that took him down pretty quick. All right, so we just got eyes on another jackal 100 yards out right there up on this hill. We'll be zeroed in for 100. And perfect shot. She's down. And that was actually a spinal cord shot at 100 yards out. Man, this thing shoots a little bit high, actually. All right, there he is. About 130 yards out coming right towards us. Actually, if he slows up there, it'd be perfect. Tried for a heart shot, and we might have gotten it. Either that or double lung. Either way, that was beautiful. Let's go over and go take a look. We did get heart. Take a look at that. What a shot. 111 yards out. Perfect heart and double lung shot. And here is the female that we hit in the intestine. So not a great shot, but still 100% in the integrity and the quick kill on that. So... So I know we're going after varmints, but how do you pass this up? This is a really nice spring buck, definitely a big goal potential, and he's 100 yards out. If we can go for a double lung heart shot, I would definitely try for it. So let's go for it. 100 yards out, we'll hold for low on the front shoulder. Right about there. And we didn't get the heart, but he's definitely smoked. Nice. All right, how do we do? Man, that's some decent penetration. We ended up getting a lung, liver, intestine, stomach shot at 102 yards out. And that is a huge goal. 925 score. Uh, that's a pretty good one. He's actually a mounter. I believe this will be our biggest spring buck in any trophy lodge so far. So, yeah, we should, we should get a mounted. Trophy rating of 107. Very nice. 
It's only going to cost 2,690 cash as well, so pretty affordable. So before we go after the Coyote, I really want to try out the air rifle on the Warthog. We have a decent size 3 out here, and he's about 110 out. Wait till he turns perfectly broadside. That's a female, and of course she's blocking our shot. Here we go. He started walking, and I think we still made a decent hit. Can we get another one? Wait till he... How'd we do on that? Maybe, oh, another good shot. Okay, female, if you're just gonna stand there. That's money. All right, so we should have three Warthog down. Now, the reason that they didn't spook is because we're shooting about 110, 115 yards out. And I think we got all three of them. We have two of them laying right here. Another one might not have been the greatest shot. Oh, right over there. So apparently it wasn't that bad of a shot. And that was the first one. I thought we had a little far back because it was started walking, but we still got an 88% on the quick kill on that with the left lung liver stomach shot at 118 yards out. I am very satisfied with that. Let's find out how we did on this one. That was a right lung liver shot, 86% on the quick kill on that. I was trying for heart, but looks like we just missed it. That was 123 yards out. Very impressive. This thing has, like I said before, the same amount of penetration as a 30 odd six. And here's our final Warthog. I think we might've hit this one in the intestine. Oh no. Wow, that was a very nice shot. Just a little bit too low and yeah, basically just a little bit too low. That was 124 yards out. We made a right lung shot. This is actually the female that I thought we smoked, but yeah, still got a right lung, 17% on the quick kill on that. And now we're gonna head out for some coyote. All right, so we just got to a really good coyote spot out here. In fact, this is where I got one of my biggest coyotes. I'll show you where we're at here in a little bit, but there is a really big pack here. I would say there's probably like eight or nine different coyotes in this pack last time I saw. All right, so it looks like we have our first coyote right here. Wow, very nice. Double lung shot and she went down instantly. It looks like we ended up making a 32 yard spinal cord and left lung shot on this coyote. Not bad. But look at how much cash we got. 1,259 cash for that. And not only that, it's an absolute blast to hunt with. All right, so we have a coyote out here. It's a female. It's not the male that called, but she's about 110 out. And that looked like it would have been a good hit. And here's our other coyote. Let's see where we did. I had a feeling we hit high. Man, this thing is so touchy. It actually shoots high at 100. So if it's 110, you literally need to hold for like 90. So we just came up over this ridge here and I spotted a pretty nice mythical coyote. He ran off over this direction here. We're going to put out a couple calls and hope that he comes back. Right there, right there, right there, right there. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that was him. We spotted a big mythical coyote here before and hopefully that was him. But all I know is that thing was close. Oh man, it wasn't him. Wrong one. 10 yards away. All right, so we have a male coyote here and I just saw two more coyotes somewhere nearby. So right there's one of them. I'm hoping we can find the mythical. A nice summary hard right there. Two more coyotes in the woods over here. One of these very well could be him. There he is. There he is. He's about 100 yards out. Okay. Let's get ready. We're zeroed in for 100. And that's not really a shot. Oh, it looks like he's going to come closer. All right, I see something right here. That could be him. It is him. And we just smoked him, but I really don't know how we missed the heart. Could have hit high, I guess. Definitely should have been lung, though. So let's go over here and go take a look. Honestly, we probably should do a consecutive check, but I think we should be all right. We're good. 911 score, and we hit just a little bit high. 
He was only 23 yards away, but 54 with a trophy rating of 911. I believe this is my second biggest coyote and a nice gold with the air rifle, which is pretty awesome. So let's get him mounted. All right, so we got eyes on two more coyotes right here. We got a three and a four. Put it right down. Can we get another one? I can't really see it very good, but we definitely hit it. I don't think we dropped it, but I could be wrong. Well, I guess that confirms it. We just dropped both coyotes back to back with the air rifle. <laughs> and that was awesome. I would say they're probably like 60 out too. 70 yards out, double lung shot on that one. You can see we hit just a little bit low, but really good penetration. And this one right here. Double lung shot at 75 yards out right there. I actually thought we would have hit this one in the back of the head because, but apparently it was facing us. I thought it was facing away from us, but that's pretty cool. All right, guys, now let me show you where we've been hunting this whole time for a coyote here. I did show you this in the diamond coyote video, but I'll show you again right now. We have a coyote need zone right here from 15 until 1930, but the ideal spot for the coyote are right here. There's a little spot right here. There's a big opening. You can see all the way around this whole area. So you want to come right here at around 1400. It'll give you a little bit of time to get ready and set up and yeah. And with that, I think we're going to head on over to the Yukon Valley and try and take down the gray wolf. Look at what we just found. That's an eight mythical, a huge gray wolf. And he's coming right our direction. He's a hundred yards out, but we need to get him within 50. All right, guys, there he is, 50 yards away, coming right towards us. Yes! We did it! Hard shot! Hard shot! We just dropped him! I've been hunting this guy for a long time. And uh, man, we just finally made it work out. And I would say we made like a 45 yard, 50 yard heart shot. Yes, 930 score. And we actually did hit him a second time as he was going down. But luckily it didn't really affect our integrity. I was kind of worried that that might mess up our integrity, but look at the penetration, 44 yards out. And we got ourselves a huge mythical 38.6 scoring, 930 gray wolf. All right, so we just got back to the trophy lodge and I think we're gonna put our coyote right here. This is our 911 scoring mythical coyote. Very cool. And we actually got a huge springbok as well. So maybe we should put him over here, 925 springbok. Yeah, that looks pretty cool there. And let's put our big gray wolf that scored. Cool, so we can actually get him mounted. 930 that's him 7400 he's gonna be a little pricey but he's worth it and let's get him mounted and put him right here there he is 930 scoring mythical gray wolf that we took down with the 45 caliber air rifle that was pretty awesome ended up getting two really good mythicals out of that a huge mythical gray wolf i think we'll leave him like that and a huge mythical coyote so yeah very good hunt Overall, that was a pretty big success, I would say. Nice. And yeah, the air rifle definitely does it again. And I think that's going to be a good way to end this video. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching. And we'll see you next time.